guys and i'm gonna share with you a look of mine which has become my favorite so to start off with i'm first obviously gonna apply the moisturizer and make sure my face is nice and moisturized and hydrated for the makeup to go on uh, go all over your face under your eyes everywhere uh, then i'm going in with some illuminator now i'm not adding any primer because i do not really want the makeup to last that long and i'm not going anywhere really so i have skipped the primer the illuminator gives your face a nice shine and a glow so i'm gonna first add that all over my face and then i'm going in with this foundation which is buff page 130 by maybelline fit me this color is quite light for me as you guys can see so i will go in and add a darker color foundation now i forgot to show you guys but that one is from mac and i'll put the shade right here so uh, now the foundation looks a bit more like my color and I was happy with that. So and now I'm going to go in and add some setting powder. I am applying a translucent setting powder to set my foundation in place. I am now going to take a concealer and conceal my under eyes. So I first apply a darker concealer. So this is me applying the darker concealer and I'm just going to blend it in nicely and then go in with a lighter concealer so this is uh, from fit me in the shade 25 medium if i'm not wrong so i'm just gonna add that on top i'm taking it a little bit below my eyes as well and on my forehead nose and chin to sort of brighten my face so i'm just gonna apply it there and then i will blend it out with a blending brush now you can obviously use your hands or your fingers as well or a beauty blender i am just more comfortable with the brushes so i'm gonna go in with the brush and i'm just gonna blend it in to make it look more natural now once you're done with the concealer you want to set the concealer in and for that we use translucent setting powder so using some setting powder i am going to add that on all the parts i have concealed so basically my under eye my forehead my nose and my chin now with the powder contour i'll be contouring my cheekbones my forehead and my jawline to give my face a more chiseled and a more deeper look now moving on to my brows i'm just gonna fill them in lightly what really happens is when you apply a ton of makeup on your face your eyebrows end up looking a little bit duller so just to make it even and to make it look normal we just fill in the eyebrows now let's go in with the blush i'm using this pretty pink color blush and i'm just gonna add that all on my cheek and as you can see this blush just changes the look i'm adding some highlighter on my cheekbones and also i'll be adding some on my nose moving on to the eyelids i'm gonna conceal my eyelids so they are ready for the eyeshadow to go on them and using this brush i'll just blend it all out to make it look natural and even using this brown color i am just gonna add that on my crease just to start off the eye makeup now i'm taking it very little by little and i'm layering the product on my eyes and i'm lightly going to add that now i'm gonna go in with darker brown and i'm going to add that on my outer corner and i'll just blend it towards the inside so as you can see i first place the color on the outside and then i'm kind of just pushing it inside now let me go on and do the same thing on the other eye as well now once that's done go in and take any pastel color of your choice as you can see i am taking a blue color and i'm going to add that on my inner corner with a small flat brush keep adding your color little by little till you are happy with the intensity as you can see i keep layering on every single makeup product that i use i don't just take a lot and one time and apply the whole thing on my eyes so layering is the key layering and blending is the key to good makeup so take your time and do it using a blue liner pencil i'm just going to add that on my lower waterline taking the same blue that we used earlier i am going to add that on my lower lash line outside my lower lash line uh, and we'll just blend it you want the look to be complete and you want the blue to kind of pop out now once that's done i'm gonna curl my lashes and then we are going to pop on some fake lashes oh my god you guys these lashes they take forever and after 10 hours i'm done with my lashes finally now since i have 
these bold blue eyes i'm going in with a very soft pink lipstick so i had this uh, lip liner which is why i'm using it otherwise for nude lipsticks i don't really use lip liners but yeah i added some light pink lipstick nude pink lipstick and that is the look we are done with the look and that is how it looks it's a very light and a subtle makeup look or uh, even though we have a very poppy color and yeah that is it for the video guys bye bye